I just got done swimming. <laughs> I'm tired. I reached a goal today. I hit 55 laps. That has been a goal for a long time. And I finally did it. Yay me. I'm tired though. <laughs> My muscles hurt. They're screaming. It wouldn't be so bad, but last week... I didn't make it to the gym at all last week. Last week was one of those what else could go wrong things. It was like I'm on my way. One day I actually went to go to the gym and I got stopped at the gate and was told I couldn't go in that I had to get my ID dealt with. It's like okay so I go over to the office to have my ID dealt with. Sat there for an hour and they wouldn't let me deal with it. I had to bring my husband with me who was in bed sleeping because he got to go to work that night. So I wasn't even allowed to go to the gym and I was like oh, this is ridiculous so you know we took care of it the next day so I was all good after that but it was very very frustrating and um, I forget what happened the other two days I just know something took place where I couldn't go and it was very very frustrating <sighs> so and today well my last video I was talking about swallowing disorder which from what I understand, when you're really heavy, you could have this swallowing disorder where, you know, they, they call it hiatal hernia, they call it all kinds of stuff. Um, I just know I couldn't swallow. And I still have that problem, but it's not near as severe as it used to be. It was very frustrating before. I would eat something, take one or two bites, the next thing I'd throw up. Couldn't eat for the rest of the day, you know, which was crazy because I couldn't... I couldn't lose weight. You know, it's like, I'm not eating enough calories to be causing weight gain, but that was what was going on. Uh, but, well, we found out what part of that problem was. But what I, um, now I don't ha I still have it, but it's not as bad as it used to be. So, that's a good thing. And I was looking at the food, you know, hearing about the food I used to eat back then, and I was thinking that was healthy not even close now when I think of Subway I think of salad and I'm thinking okay do I want a tuna salad or a <laughs> chicken salad or something like that instead of a sandwich or something like that and for your information if you really got to have that Subway sandwich ask for a kid size not a six inch a kid size is about three or four inches of a sandwich it's a, it's a little bit smaller. It's better for you. You know, and, and if anything, just pile on more veggies or something like that. But, uh, yeah, when I've gotten to the point where if I go to any of those places, restaurants, name it. I usually ask for the kid's size because that's usually the proper portion size food that I want. Um, and if I don't, what I usually do is carry... Um, uh, storage containers for you know for your leftovers or something like that because I know I'm going to have leftovers over as it is and I don't want that styrofoam stuff at home so I would bring my own containers order my food and uh, put what I don't want to eat you know like I'll take half my food or more and put it in the containers and then eat what's left if I can and uh, it works out a whole lot better so I can still eat pretty much what I want I just don't eat as much of it so uh, anyway, yesterday I cooked a whole bunch of food for the dogs. It was fish, sweet potatoes, potatoes, green beans, and broccoli. It was actually pretty good. I liked it. I made a video, of course. It'll be coming along eventually. Um, since it's all new, making dog food like that. And I, you know, they love it. They just eat it up like crazy. And I just realized how much of it's ending up in the freezer because not all of it gets eaten in a week. And I don't want it going bad, so I freeze a lot of it. But I'm trying all these different recipes. And hopefully when Lopez goes back to his family, I'll have some backup food for him. So, anyway, I am going to... i got to go find my hubby. And then I have studying to do. I have, I'm like three days behind on my studies. And I have a pile of mail to get to. And I have about 20, 20 pairs of pants to take care of for customer. I think I'm going to be busy. Wish me luck. <laughs>